Hi guys, I wanted to do another cloth diaper review. The next cloth diaper I'm going to be reviewing is actually off Etsy.com. And if you guys don't know what Etsy is, it's all like handmade stuff. And if you don't know what Etsy is, you're probably living under a rock and you should go check it out. Um, this brand is actually called Sassy Cloth. I did have to wait like I think even a little over a month. They said like two to three weeks. But it was like a little over a month that was handmade. Um, but that's okay because the baby wasn't even here yet. And this is a one size um, pocket diaper. Um, so I'll go ahead and show you guys what it looks like. It does have the crossover snaps here, as you can see, which is great. It's got double crossover snaps. So it got really, um, really tight. It's got, there's the waist snaps, and it is a one size. So it does have um, a rise on it. I'll show you guys. So as you can see, it has a three stop rise. For, so for a small, medium, and large baby, it's supposed to, like, I think estimated, I want to say, like, 8 to 35 pounds, like, birth to potty training. Um, it didn't quite fit her until, I think she was about a month old. So she was probably about, like, I'd say 9, 9 or 10 pounds. And then here's the inside of it. Now, um, this diaper did not come with an insert. It was just the diaper. But we do have it stuffed with our Ozo Cozy um, better fit newborn size um, purple edge pre filth which we love those and I'll do a separate review on those. Um, I mean, this diaper, it's okay. It's not my favorite diaper. It's not the first one I grabbed for. Um, but I do like it. I mean, I don't have too many complaints. Um, I do like, you know, that the elastic is super stretchy. Um, in the back, I actually like that this pocket here. Um, that this part has elastic because a lot of times it's just the back part that has elastic and then the actual pocket itself doesn't have elastic and that's really annoying. So I, you know, I do like that on the inside. Um, I believe it's just like, um, micro fleece. And, um, you know, like I said, it's, it's an alright diaper. Obviously with snaps you can't get as much customized fit as you can with, um, Aplex, but obviously Velcro does have its cons as well. Now this is a pocket diaper, like I said, so it's just stuffed with one of our pre -folds. So I'll show you the inside. Okay, so this is actually the inside of the diaper. Um, it's like... I don't think it's PUL, I think it's TPU, and I don't exactly know what the TPU stands for, um, this waterproof material, but it is a lot stickier than I'm used to, and it is very annoying and hard to stuff, um, but, you know, that's that. Um, you know, like I said, it's a good diaper, not the first one I grabbed for, but we really, you know, it's, it's a good diaper, we do like it. So this is the biggest the diaper can get. It's on open all the way on the very last snap. As you can see, it's a pretty big diaper. Pretty big toddler can fit into that. Um, I don't think it's as big as all the one size diapers I've seen. We don't really have a problem with that yet because my daughter's only four months old. But if she tends to be on the bigger side when she gets older, then we may have an issue with that. Okay, and this is the smallest that the diaper can get. My daughter is, I'm, I'm going to guess around 15 pounds. She hasn't been weighed in a while. Um, but she is almost four months old. She'll be four months old in a week. She's on almost the smallest setting. She's actually, she's, we still use the crossover snap for her. But she is actually just right there. So, um, the snaps are pretty good, they're pretty, like, I like them pretty good, and um, they're really reinforced. And then also there's this, like, it's not, I don't want to say double, like, gossip because it's not, but it's just kind of, like, um, like, different material around the legs. Um, gives it, like, a little bit something unique to it, so that's nice, I like that. Um, I think the stripper was, like, $13.99 or something like that, $13.50, and I paid $15 altogether with shipping included. So that's actually not a bad price. Um, there's some like cheaper brands you can get for cheaper, but for in handmade and you know it is the Cowboys and my husband is a big Cowboys fan, so 
Wearing a maid diaper is really not bad for her and seems to be comfy on her. So if you guys have any more um, cloth diaper requests, put them in the comments below. I plan to have a lot more of these diaper videos coming. Plus I'm getting a lot more diapers in the mail to add to my stash. So soon I should be doing um, a cloth diaper stash video. And my daughter is, like I said, almost four months. So we still have a lot more cloth diapering left. So again, any requests or comments, um, put them down below. And I'll get to them as soon as I can. Thanks, guys.